G'day guys, it's Dry here. Welcome to Disney vs Pixar Attack of the Brackets. So this is something that's been going around a lot lately that I've seen on my Twitter and things like that. Where people have been doing this. Also, Good, Myth Mor Good Mythical Morning did this with um, food. So I'm going to do it with Disney vs Pixar because your girl loves Pixar and Disney movies. So let's start on this side, which is Lion King vs Tarzan. Straight up, I'm going to have to go with Lion King. Princess Frog vs Lilo and Stitch. Ooh, that's hard actually because I've only seen Princess and the Frog once, and same with Lilo and, Lilo and Stitch. But Ohana means family. I think Lilo and Stitch had a, a like more of a connection to me, whereas Princess and the Frog was fun and had lots of graphics and it was beautiful. But Lilo and Stitch was just there. Tangle and Big Hero Six. Big Hero Six. Frozen Moana. Moana did not like Frozen. Aladdin or Hercules? I haven't actually seen Hercules, so I'm gonna have to go with Aladdin. Little Mermaid, Pocahontas. Little Mermaid. If you don't know, I'm an avid fan of the Little Mermaid. Like she's my favorite person of all time. Mulan or Zootopia? <sighs> Ooh, ooh, that's hard. Because Zootopia was actually quite fun to watch, but Mulan was more. I'm gonna have to go with Mulan. And Beauty and the Beast and Nightmare for Christmas. Nightmare for Christmas is my other favorite movie of all time. Again, so let's do this. Let's. Let's go to Pixar now. Up or Brave? I'm gonna have to go with Brave. Toy Story the Emperor's New Groove. New Groove. Coco or Toy Story? Gokka. Toy Story 3 or Treasure Planet? Treasure Planet was my favorite movie all time growing up. Ratatouille or Bugs Life? Ratatouille. Finding Nemo or Inside Out? That's hard actually. Because Finding Nemo was such a good movie. Where you could just watch it all the time and it's fun, but Inside Out was just fun and creative and it was different. And it was something that hadn't really been done before, so. I loved Finding Dory. I have to go with Inside Out. Monsters Inc. or Cars? I'm not a big fan of Cars. Monsters Inc. The Incredibles or Wally? Wally! The Incredibles, because The Incredibles are coming out not only with the second one, but that was such a good movie, in my opinion. But I love the chemistry between Wally and Evie. But I love like the family and like the jokes in The Incredibles. Wally, if Wally was against like anything else, I would have probably chosen Wally other than Treasure Planet. Okay. So Brave versus The Emperor's New Groove. Have to go Brave. Coco versus Treasure Planet. No. I love Treasure Planet, but Coco, Coco, no. That's hard! I can't do that! I'm gonna have to go with Treasure Planet! Because it holds such a special place in my heart! But Coco... Oh no! Ratatouille or Inside Out? I'm not going to Ratatouille. Monsters Inc. or The Incredibles? The Incredibles! Treasure Planet is, is there. And then I have to go with The Incredibles. So out of those two, we'll wait and see. I think you guys have figured it already because you guys are super smart. The Lion King or Leon Stitch? Damn. Um. Well, I'm going to go from both. Night Before Christmas, Little Mermaid. Ooh. Now these two are hard. Moana or Big Hero 6? Because Moana was such an amazing, like, Character, like, character development when it came to females in Disney because they started doing more cultural stuff. They did a little bit in the past, but that was kind of more cultural. But Big Hero 6 talked about so many different things, and I thought that was such an underrated movie, and I thought it was really good. But like, Moana, Moana, make way, make way, Moana. I'm gonna have to look Moana. No, it wasn't. Big Hero 6. Lion King and Little Stitch. I'm gonna have to go with Lion King. I think Big Hero 6 definitely beats Lion King. <sighs> now this is the hardest one. The Little Mermaid Nightmare for Christmas. If you know absolutely nothing about me, I'm gonna tell you something right now. The Little Mermaid, I grew up on that movie. That was a movie that 
I watched all the time. I wanted to be Ariel. I wanted to be. I've seen all of the movies that she's been. I wanted to voice act when I was older. I wanted to voice act as Melody when she was older. I love that film with all my heart. I don't know why, but there's just something about it. It just makes me feel so happy. And watching it, it just it it just is such a comfort thing. You know, everyone has their comfort films. I guess Ariel's my comfort film. But A Night Before Christmas, I watch that every year without fail. I watch it every Halloween, every Christmas, every... You know, no matter what. Even when I was like one years old, my mum told me that I used to watch that. So they both hold such a special place in my heart. I honestly don't know if I can choose. It's gonna be hard because like... Little Mermaid means the world to me. But so does A Night Before Christmas. I'm gonna have to pick, and I... I'm gonna have to go with Nightmare for Christmas. Like, Nightmare for Christmas is gonna win that easily. And Treasure Planet wins that one. This is so hard! Treasure Planet or Nightmare for Christmas? I'm gonna have to go with Nightmare for Christmas. Treasure Planet. Nightmare for Christmas. Ah, both. Again, I also grew up in Treasure Planet. So... I'm going based off like growing up things. <sighs> Nightmare for Christmas it is. But damn that was hard. Because like like I was saying, I grew up on Nightmare for Christmas. I grew up on Little Mermaid. I grew up on Treasure Planet. And I loved Treasure Planet. Like I love that film. Everyone hates it, but I love that film. I don't care if the graphics are bad. I don't care. I thought that film was damn amazing and I love that film. But I'm gonna have to go with Nightmare for Christmas because that will always hold a special place in my heart. Yeah. If you want to play this, it is called Attack of the Bracket, www.attackofthebracket.com, created by Justin Hook, not affiliated with Disney, or Pix or Disney, yeah, because Disney and Pixar are the same thing. Um, but yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like the Attack of the Brackets, maybe you guys could leave me some suggestions of other brackets I could do and I'll try them out. I don't know. Anyway, drop out. See you guys in the next video. Sarcasm out. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye. See ya. I feel like I just betrayed my soul because I betrayed the Little Mermaid and I betrayed Treasure Planet and I betrayed Coco in the beginning. Ah, I'm sorry. Yes.